Hi guys, Steve here. This is a follow-on from the last time you last received this video. I've refined it even more, read your comments and come up with a new way of shooting it. And on this one I'm going to clear up a few bits of misinformation. Let's kite it back between the stone behemoth gates. As before, when the whale gets trapped between the doors, it straightens up. You walk underneath it, it doesn't do any damage. You keep clicking to put the second behemoth gates down. When it's clear, it places it. Put a behemoth gate in. Close the front behemoth gate to shield it. Then you can go to your strider with a cannon. Thank you for suggesting this. These are very easy to tame. I'll link a video on how to do it at the end. A much cheaper and a less hassle than making a mech with a cannon. Plus you'd have to unlock the mech engram. Shoot the whale in the head once. The behemoth gate door protects its body from any splash damage. Then go up to the Astrocetus. And you'll find it's knocked out with one hit. Go around to its middle. And feed it some extraordinary kibble. Also tried to play a shoulder cannon, it doesn't work. And the golem thrown rocks at it, which doesn't work. Delete the back behemoth gate so you can free it. Then just wait for it to get hungry. A few of you thought that when I ran super speed into the whale and damaged it, before I started torporing it, was the reason why the taming effectiveness was 80%. It's not. You can damage a creature as much as you want before you torpor it. Only when you start knocking it out does the damage count. I'll skip forward a bit because it's going to take a while before it gets hungry. There you go, 80% as always. Like I said on the last video, the only way I've found to get that higher is to up the taming rates on your server. It's going to take a while for a second bite, so I'll skip forward again. It says at 80% effectiveness I'll get 60 levels added. But on a second bite it'll only give me 50. So in total it'll only come out at level 200. I wish your devs would fix this. It's only been a year. There we go, we tamed it. And that's the most optimum way to tame an Astrocetus. Just shoot it once with a Strider Cannon. Like I say, it's a hell of a lot easier taming one of those than making a mech with a cannon. It's far superior. And that's how easy it is to tame an Astrocetus now. Thanks to the power of Nooblets. Oh, and a few of you have said, very nice, but you can't build on a space bridge on a fish hole. Well, you're wrong, because I tested it before I made the video live. This is me logging on to the second official PvP server. Join that one. Take a note of the name, because I'll be showing it again once I get in. Right, I'm going to speed everything up from here and I'm going to show you putting foundations down on the space bridge to prove that you can build on it. For you doubters, you can keep watching. And for everyone else, please like if you thought this was helpful. Subscribe if you're not already. Click the bell notifications and all and share with your friends. And I'll see you on the next video.
assume they ran out of time to get the destination before launching this ship. We seem to be jumping from star system to star system across the galaxy, probably scanning for habitable worlds. Over here, mate. 